What is up, my clan? Welcome back to some Call of Duty Advanced Warfare. Uh, Black Ops 3. Right around the corner, you guys. Right around the corner. And uh, let me tell you, I'm super, super excited about it. But you know, I feel like I didn't give... I didn't give... Um, is this the Elite one? This is the Insanity. Yeah, alright. Um, I feel like I didn't give Advanced Warfare the time it deserved, or the time that I normally give Call of Duty titles. Um, typically, when I get a Call of Duty game, I play the crap out of it for a year, right? Until the next Call of Duty comes out. And uh, I get all the DLCs. <sighs> ah, man. That's not a sniper rifle. Let's go back to this one. I like this one better. It's got the, it's got the red dot. Need that red dot. Oh, man. The recoil is real. The recoil is real. Um... I typically give it a year, and Advanced Warfare, I did not give the time it deserved because, well, because of Destiny, and because I was playing GTA 5, and I was playing, you know, a couple of the titles, and then I would go a while without playing. But more importantly, the reason why Advanced Warfare did not get the time it deserved is because I switched consoles, right? So, Ghosts was the last console that I had, that I, that I, uh, was on my PS3, last COD that I had on PS3, and all my friends were on PS3. Well, I jumped over to PS4. And now everybody followed. Um, only a handful of my original Call of Duty buddies um, went to PS4. And uh, and so it made it kind of difficult to play Call of Duty because I'd log online and there'd be nobody to play with. And I'll be honest with you, man, and I've said this numerous times, guys, playing video games with friends is the best thing about video games, right, in my opinion. Like, I like these types of games where I'm playing with, with multiple people, right? It's online multiplayer. Online multiplayer is my favorite thing. First-person shooters are my favorite thing. And playing with, you know, a party of four or five people, or hell, you know, well, five being I'd be the sixth man, but that's the best thing to play with. And you get a full party of people chatting and, and you know, BSing and talking smack. And, like, I looked forward to those Friday nights. Friday night COD nights were the best, right? My brother-in-law, Jack, from the Vivos, he'd get on, he'd play with me. We had, like, three or four guys we played with on the regular. Um, I used to have a, I used to be in a COD clan, like that was what I loved about, on you know I fell in love with PlayStation and I fell in love with the whole COD and, and all that stuff because it, it was the whole camaraderie part of it, right? I switched to PS4 thinking though everyone's gonna switch to PS4, right? I even waited a year. I didn't even get my PS4 until it was already out for a year. I switch over and there's only a handful of people on my friends list and I'm totally bummed out. I'm like, all right, well I got nobody to, to really play with, right? And so I had a couple guys, we played a couple matches, and we played the zombie when the first zombie map came out, we, we played zombies, and, you know, we had a good time. But the, but the thing is, that, that camaraderie and that um, friendship that I had in, in Call of Duty moved over to Destiny. I found that in Destiny. I have a Destiny clan now that are, that are 15, 16 deep, and every time I log on, I have at least four or five people to play with on Destiny. I just still don't have that with Call of Duty Advanced Warfare. I might have maybe four people that I know on a regular basis play Call of Duty. And when I log online, now it's at the point now I've got to like message somebody and be like, hey, do you want to play Call of Duty? You know? And one of the things I hate is when I'm playing Destiny and someone messaged me saying, hey, you want to play Call of Duty? Like, no, man, I'm playing Destiny. If I want to play Call of Duty, I'd be playing Call of Duty. Right? That thing annoys me. So I don't want to annoy my friends with the same question. Like, you know, they're in playing Batman or, or, or uh, Assassin's Creed. I don't want, you know, I, don't, I wouldn't want to message them and be like, hey, man, you want to go play some Call of Duty? So it just made it, made it very difficult with, with Advanced Warfare. I'm hoping now with Black Ops 3, it's been another year. Hopefully some more of my friends have stepped up and got a PlayStation 4. Um... <laughs> I, heck, I might even deleted some of those old guys, those guys I used to play with because, uh, you know, I, I, I went a whole year without playing with them. I don't know. I gotta look. I know I have, I have a handful of, of, like, hardcore, like, my buddies I played with on a regular basis with Call of Duty that are still on my friends list because when I do log on, I see them playing zombies. I see them playing Advanced Warfare. Um, but usually by then it's too late. I'm already in, in a raid or a match uh, with, with uh, Destiny. And so... Get wrecked, punk. Enemy the air. Enemy care so yeah, Advanced Warfare. You're probably gonna get one more video of Advanced Warfare, and it will probably be titled my last Call of Duty Advanced Warfare video. Because, like I said, once I get Black Ops 3, I'm not gonna want to come back to Advanced Warfare. I'm just not. Like, Black Ops 3 is the new hotness. That's what most people are gonna be playing. Um, 
there's no reason to go back. I have a lot of friends that still play uh, Black Ops 2, and I always want, I'm always shaking my head going, why? Why? You got ghosts, you got advanced warfare, why go back to Black Ops 2? It's, it's old. Like, at this point, you've been playing it for three years, almost four years, right? Like, why go back to that old game? In my opinion, it's not that much better than the, this, this game. If anything, this game's better because of the, the, the changes, the differences in exosuits. Like, Black Ops 2 is just like every other COD with just, an, just a different timepiece, different skin, right? The weapons are cool. There were some, definitely some cool weapons in there. But every game's got cool weapons, right? This game introduced the whole, like, energy-based weapons. And um, that shotgun that, like, shoots like a... It, sound, it seems like it shoots like a puff of air. <laughs> you know what I mean? It knocks them back. But, um... Yeah, I don't know, man. Like... Like I said, I'm, I'm definitely a Call of Duty player. I miss it. I like the simplicity of this. I, I literally just grab this controller and I grab a gun and start shooting people, you know, in the face. Like, I love that simplicity of that. I love it. And Destiny is, is complex. As much as I love the complexity of Destiny, even their Crucible matches, you know, are more complex because of uh, the, the mechanics of the game. This is purely a running gun shooter, and that's what I love. That's what that's my that's my jam. That's the reason why I don't play GTA 5 more because I don't care for that kind of gameplay. As much as I try to get into it and play it, it's just not my jam. You'll probably get maybe one or two more GTA 5 videos from me. This guy's in this tree. Oh no, I thought that guy was in a tree. You, know, you might get one or two more GTA 5 videos from me. I'll probably make one like this saying why I don't play any more GTA 5. And then you might get one more saying it's my last one. I don't know. But the, de the end of the day, guys, when I log on to PlayStation, especially for streaming, I have no desire to sit in GTA 5 for any length of time. I log on, I make a, I make a video because I know you guys want to see it. It makes you guys happy. And don't get me wrong, it's still fun driving around from the cars, but it's that simple. It's just driving around playing cars. I don't enjoy the gameplay in general. So, I uh, hope you understand. Hope you enjoyed this video. Click it a thumbs up if you did. Let me know in the comments down below if you're getting Black Ops 3 um, and what your favorite part of Advanced Warfare was or why you didn't like Advanced Warfare. And uh, we'll see you guys next time.